Police are investigating the fatal shooting of 47-year-old Braun Dumar of Grand River Denry. Dumar was shot and killed while playing cards along a roadway in Denry. My niece called me and told me they shot, they shot um, Rata, they shot Rata. It's, it's hard, it's heartbreaking. The young guys need to put the guns down and go, go closer to God. Because some of them, they doesn't go to church like they don't have a God. But to me, that's, it's not nice. It's not nice. Yeah, because I can tell you it's painful. I can feel the pain in my heart. Unable to express their grief in words, some wailed in agony as they grappled with the loss of their loved one. Police say Braun suffered multiple gunshot wounds and was pronounced dead at the scene by a medical professional. His daughter said her father's legal troubles nearly 22 years ago led him to advocate for peaceful conflict resolution. My father wasn't really in my life for the childhood part. Um, when I was three years old, he was... He, well, he went to prison, he basically came out when I was a young teenager, secondary school. Um, but from the time he came out, we, he really tried to build a bond. We were getting along, always checking on me, providing for me how we can until this day. So that's what it's been. He was a nice person. Um, he always encouraged people to do good, I guess, before with the experience that he's had. Um, he would not encourage violence or crime for that matter. He would always try to speak sense into people that would probably want to take a path like him. So I could say that he was a changed person and wanted good and better. A resident claims the victim received death threats before his death. Fella had said like, he would have killed a man. He have to kill a man. You know, by the field yesterday, the man was keep on saying that all the time, you know. But I don't know him, I don't know. But I just heard that. But he was a good guy, but he was go moving around, giving jokes with all, everybody, you understand? So not to say well, like he's a person looking for trouble, getting trouble, nothing like that, you know. I can't say nothing bad about him. Yes, What's the mood? What's the mood in the community about this day? What's the mood? Like how are people feeling about this? Oh, why? Everybody feel bad. I feel that. Everybody feel wow. Everybody crying about that. Even in case I tell you last night when I heard that, I just start to cry. Start to cry. You know. Residents expressed concern over the recent surge in violence on the island. It's just sad. Any way you look at it, anyhow you look at it, it's just a sad situation. Every day is a killing. People scared of going out of their house, you know, to do sometimes little stuff. It's just a sad situation all over. Please stop that killing, you know, unite with one another. Talk to um, each other about your problem. Stop the violence, please. The motive and suspects are unknown. Anyone with information can contact the Rich Four Police Station at 456-3690. The Major Crimes Unit at 456-3754. Or the Crime Hotline anonymously at 555.